zippity doo -dah. beautiful day, great to be alive. Hey, what's up everyone, this is Chris Brown here again. Uh, as you can see me behind me, I'm hanging out here at the Yacht Beach Club here in Walt Disney World. But what we've been doing over the past couple of videos or so is we've been asking this question of how much do you know about your, your taxes, how much do you know about your cash flow, how much do you know about investing, how much do you know about marketing, right? And one of the things that Mark Cuban says is that you can't delegate what you don't know. And we put our trust in all of these advisors, but uh, if we don't understand this part of our business, or if we don't get ourselves at least moderately educated on this part of their, our business, we leave ourselves open to being taken advantage of. And uh, we don't want that to happen. Um, that's why we're creating these videos, even if you decide to never do business with us. We want you to, to, to help you to get this part of your business handled. So over the past couple of videos or so, we've been talking about and reviewing some of the, the stuff in, when it comes down to your business en entities, right? Your corporations, your uh, general partnerships, uh, DBAs, things of that sort, right? So what we've been doing is we've been reviewing a book called uh, Own Your Own Corporation. It's in the Rich Dad Poor Dad series because uh, we can't hire good advice uh, most, most, in most cases. And so since we can't hire good advice, we, what we want to do instead, or what we can do, even if we can't afford the, to hire these big expensive lawyers to get this area of our business handled, uh, we can read their books. And so what we've been doing here is we're reviewing some of these things to make sure that your business is protected. So in today's video, like I said, I promised you yesterday, in today's video what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how an electrician, I'm gonna show you how a handyman was able to totally alleviate this 15% in self-employment tax and how you can do the same thing. But to be able to do that, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go ahead and take you to my computer and so uh, we can go ahead and explain that and kinda of show you how this works, okay? But uh, come on with me as we go on over there. Okay, so one of the things that we've talked about over the past few videos is this statement from Mark Cuban of Shark Tank. And one of the things that he says is that you can't delegate what you don't know. And so over the past few videos, we've asked you this question of how much do you know about your taxes? How much do you know about investing? How much do you know about cash flow? How much do you know about marketing? You know, most of you understand the thing that you do, your craft, but a lot of you don't understand these different areas of your business. And so what happens most of the time, and you're still going to do this, is most of the time we will hire this out to experts and advisors who really understand this part. However, if we don't understand at least the basics, we leave ourselves as victim to having somebody else take advantage of us. You know, uh, I do provide a little, a lot of uh, sales and marketing services, right? And some of you may look at me with an eye of skepticism because you don't understand this area of your business, right? And so at least understand the basic levels of this. This is why we're providing you these videos so you'll actually understand these different areas of business. Even if you decide to never go with us, at least you'll uh, be educated enough and know enough about these different areas of your business to not let somebody take advantage of you. So what you see in front of you, this is what is called as an income statement. It talks about your income, uh, your expenses, your assets, and your liabilities. And again, some of those terms you might not know what they mean, and it's because that you haven't gotten this part of your business handled. You know the thing that you do, but now we need to really understand our business. So, um, but it might look a little bit small on the screen, and if it is, uh, we've provided a link down below directly underneath this video. That way, you can. Uh, completely open it up and really see it in, in much more detailed. Um, but let's look at this first area, okay? And the first area, you see it circled in red there, and this is earned income. This is what this is the type of income that majority of you are making. You're exchanging time for money. And a lot of you, exchanging time for money is the only way that you know how to make money. There's a, a couple of other ways, and we'll talk about this later, but the problem with earned income, not only do you make the least amount per hour, it is the, one of the things that has the lowest commercial value. Doesn't mean that it's not valuable, it just doesn't have a high commercial value. You know, generally you're not gonna see somebody make $300 an hour, right? Um, because of the amount of value that, that, that 
commercially is acceptable. Um, but with with that being said, earned income has a is uh, gets paid at a lower rate, but it all, is also one of the highest taxed. So not only as a small business do you pay forty percent in taxes or around forty percent in taxes, but you also have about another fifteen percent in what is called a self employment tax as a self employed business owner. Again, exchanging time for money, earned income. Now there are other types of income. So uh, let's look at the next area, which is what is called as passive income. And passive income, you might, depending on some some uh, the contacts and some different things, you might spend you know 15, 20 percent on your taxes for that. Um, however, uh, we you know so you're you're going to spend less, even if you make make the same amount of money as earned income, you will pay definitely less in taxes. Now, over the next couple of videos, you're going to hear about a guy by the name of Michelle. Okay, yes, it is a guy, and it, it's a uh, it is a guy's name too, um, in certain countries. But anyway, uh, this gentleman is a electrician, just like what many of you are doing, having earned income, very labor intensive businesses. Uh, however, he has a passive income side of his business. So while he's busy working on his electrician business exchanging time for money uh, during his work week he made three thousand dollars he also made another seven thousand dollars on Sunday on his day off because his business was working hard for him without him actually have to have to be working okay and that's what it's all called as a passive income your your business is working hard for you even though that you are not working then We'll look. Then there is what is called as portfolio-based income. Um, this is investments and different things of this sort. Um, as you can see, portfolio-based income, investments, dividends, royalties, things of this sort. Um, my aunt. Let me just real tell you tell you a real quick story about my great aunt. She has not worked since the late 1940s. She's 99 years old. Has not worked since the late 40s, and she gets paid off of dividends because of investments that she made. So she made money back in the 1940s. She, she, she's the inventor of Cheetos. So she got a big lump sum of that, uh, spent a couple of years learning about investing, and then took that money and invest, invested it, and she gets paid dividends, okay? And uh, you can get paid, you're, you're taxed at anywhere between a 0% off of a, a portfolio-based income to about 20%. So as you can see here, there's things that you can do. You don't have to make, and even if you make the same amount of money, you are taxed at a much, much, much lower rate. And so one of the things that we do suggest you to check out is uh, the the book in the Rich Dad Poor Dad series, which is own your own corporation. It's going to go into this more in depthly, and you can even contact Gary or. Uh, uh, Garrett Sutton, who is the author of that book, and we've we've found some arrangements for where we can actually get in contact with his offices. Um, we provided you with some links for those down below directly underneath this video as well. And that way you can ask him any questions on this because I'm not a tax advisor, but I do know some of this area stuff, so I'm not giving you per se tax advice but uh, but um, what I do want to suggest you to do is get in contact with Gary Sutton or go through the resources that we provided you and that way you can understand these different areas of your business now I hope this information has been helpful I had a blast filming this video for you here today hopefully you get to come out here and spend some time with us hang out at some of these cool places but if you're ready to take the next step if you look down below, directly underneath this video, you'll find the links and everything that you need to be able to go ahead and, and get started. But I do hope this information was helpful. Take care, everyone. Have a great day, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye-bye now. Now, again, I hope this information has been helpful. Now, I want to send you out your free DVD and invite you to get started with what we call as the Unfair Advantage Marketing System, where you will discover how to use the money your competition is spending in advertising to get you more business. Now, the very first time I did this, I used $100,000 that my competitors had already spent in advertising, and I used that money to be able to land myself 141 sales within my very first six hours in business and a brand, brand new business. Next, 
you will see how to harness the spending power of your customers who are spending money with other businesses in order to allow you to make 10 to 20 times more profits from your already established customer base. Now, we all know that our customers are spending money with other businesses besides us, right? However, we're gonna help you to use the money that your customers are spending with other businesses in order to make 10 to 20 times more profits from your already existing customer base with little or no extra work. Now your customers are spending money with other businesses anyway, but in the past you've lost all of this money. We're gonna help you to capitalize on this money. Next, we'll also reveal the secrets of what companies like Apple, Disney, and McDonald's do to never have to pay out of pocket for their business expenses ever again, and how you can do the same thing, and that way you can keep 100% of every dime that you make from your business as 100% pure profit. Now, how many of you struggle getting everything done? Probably quite a lot of you, right? So you'll also get access to our six and seven figure business advisors to make sure that you finish what you start and help you to have the same advantages and advisors that big Fortune 500 companies get. And that way you can use these type of things as well. You know, most small businesses are left to pretty much figure everything out on their own where business is a team sport. Now, how many of you love sales, right? Uh, hopefully you do, but if you don't, there's no need to worry because for those of you who don't, you also get access to our six and, fe six and seven figure income earners sales teams who will do the sales for you, allowing you to focus on what it is that you do best and much, much, much more. So you can get started by looking directly underneath this video, clicking on the link down below directly underneath this video, or if you're watching this video on YouTube, you can head on over to the website freedvd.prostarprofits.com in order to get started. But I do hope this information has been helpful. I had a blast filming this video for you here today. Take care, everyone. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.